Hello everyone, Triple here back with some more Long Dark. Now, last we saw, we just finished scouring this house. I need to sleep. Uh, yeah, that'll do. I'm going to be in bad shape when I wake up, I expect. Because of the fact that my calories are going to be very low. Dehydrated and probably starving. Oh, shit. Uh, yeah, so conditioned. Eat. Smash can. Fuck it. Let me go. Speed poisoning. No. What? No. Oh, okay. For inventory. 24%. I would drink almost anything about now. Right, where is it? I need some of these, but no. Uh, no, downstairs. Neom. Neom. Into the kitchen. Into the oven. That's what I'm going to do. It's my old trick from when I first started playing on this game. Food and drink. Sort by condition. No. No. 36. That'll be fine. Inventory. Right, so let's drink some soda. Let's get these calories back up. No, inventory. Remember it. Dog food. Uh, and crack. Eating. 450. Only 10% was lost. That's not bad. Peanut butter. Oh yeah. I'm gonna get some peanut butter. Hunger yeah. still a little bit. Okay, sardines. And then have a drink of water. And we are good to go. With no form of defense whatsoever. And there is a blizzard outside, so I should probably have checked or changed what it's wearing. So I didn't find some stuff. Blue scarf. Definitely. Um, hair. Probably done this indoors in the warm rather than freezing and doing it. Then we will sweat it. We will sweat Where? Shoes.
way. But nothing's following me. So I'm hoping it's just a simple case of follow the road and at the end of the road there'll be another join between this and Pleasant Valley. And what, if it isn't at the end of the road, that means it's going to be further up into the mountains somewhere. And I have no idea where that's going to be. Houses. I'm going to be checking some houses on the way. Which I do need to do because while I've had a good start, I don't have... So Cold. Shut up. I need defense. So I need to find a knife or a hatchet or some ammunition. Or even just a flare. I just need to find something to tide me over until I'm a bit better stopped. Now. What I've got to worry about. It's okay, Chip. Don't worry. It's just a freaking rabbit. Waterfront cottage. Oh. oh, that was close. I think he was after the rabbit and didn't see me. Right on. Need to make sure I'm using the correct one. Oh, wait, I've only got the one of mine. Yes, because I've died since I had two. Keep forgetting that. I could use this. Yeah, this is actually the eighth or ninth video I've recorded of this in a row. Maybe. I, I, yeah, I, I recorded a lot on Friday when they released the update. Yeah, the Friday of the update, I think the next day I recorded six episodes. That'll come in handy. Today, this is going to be my third, I think. So yeah, I've been playing this game a lot, just to get to the new area and get it unlocked. So if I die, I can actually choose to spawn there when I start a new game, which would be nice. So I want to explore as much as possible. I mean, I've seen Hope all the needs this anymore. What I haven't seen myself, I've seen through other people. So I've seen all that has to offer. I have not seen anything of the new area, and I really really want to. Hang on a minute. Did I check that? Yes, I did check. Oh. How did I miss pork and beans? Oven. Switching. And nothing. Septic. Hmm. Could come in handy. Especially with the number of wolf attacks that happen in this game. What have we here? Hmm. Been little beaches. It's a very common thing. But yes, um, I have been saying to a few people that I'm actually tempted to tweet the developer or Hinterland Studios and make a suggestion of a particular consumable in this game. Being set in Canada, I feel it only be right that there should be in either here or here, even in one of the cupboards if they find it. Could go in there. Poutine! Yes, a Canadian dish which us English don't get to have unless we try and make it ourselves. And if those of you who don't know what this. poutine is, if you're also from the UK like myself, it's essentially chips or fries to the overseas view. So chips, gravy, and cheese curds. And you think, ew, that might sound quite nasty. Cheese curds, yeah. It looks delicious. And someone actually made a pizza That'll routine. Come in handy. So it's just pizza base, chips, gravy, cheese curds over the top. This just looks good. But yeah, it's, this game is set in Canada. So I think they should include poutine. I haven't decided whether I'm going to 
actually suggested to the owner because they've obviously got a lot of stuff they're working on including the story mode so I might just leave them to it they've done a good job so far Hallelujah. I don't know how many that was but five that's better than none Okay, automatically put stuff. Handy. Right, and we're getting close to the end of the episode, so I'll probably end it in this house. I'm a little bit I'm concerned about going back anymore. outside this house after seeing what, what was running past as I entered. Rock boots. Searching, searching, basic curves, searching, nothing. Ooh, hello. At least I've got a better chance of surviving an attack now. Because, yeah, the rifle's great for, for they're not too close, but as soon as they jump you, unless you've got something sharp, heavy, and blunt, or sharp or heavy and blunt, you ain't going to do much damage with your fists. But. I'm happy. I have a knife now. I can stab the little bastards in their little bastard heads. And it's only nine in the morning. And I check for them. I check for them. I need to sort my inventory out. So I'll get down here, go into the kitchen. Speed light. Let's have a look. So we've got. Do, 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 do. Okay, so this lot could all be harvested. Okay, I don't realize how much I actually had of this stuff. That's a lot of new print. Yeah, so if you guys are, if there's still people watching this and they're still thinking, do I get it, do I not? I'm going to put it this way. This game is in early access, it's an alpha. We've still got to go through beta and then final release or final retail release, for example. Not, not retail, but you know what I mean, the, the final version. When all, everything's been updated and done. We still have a while to go before it's at that stage and already this game is amazing graphically perfect for me it's not very realistic it's not cell shaded i don't know what they call it but it's it's really really good graphics the gameplay is addictive it's it sucks you in the atmosphere is amazing i mean you can have music on in the background but i've turned that off to get more the feel that I come here, look, look, I'm there, Oops, not here, there in the game. I do that a lot with a lot of games, I turn off music just to sort of get more of a I'm actually there type feel. Right, just go equip that one. No, equip. Clothing, that's what I needed to check. 0.2, a harvest. But yeah, so I'll probably finish up doing these things here. Then I'll call it an episode. So while I'm doing this, I'll say, yeah, this game, you shouldn't even need to think. This should be automatic purchase, to be honest. It's that good a game. I have not had any problems with it. But am I wearing socks? Scarf. Underwear, jeans, socks. 0.4, not. 0.5, not. Wear. 0.9, wear. So, harvest. Yeah, so, graphically amazing. You just need to go through the previous, God knows how many videos I've done to see that. 
quite often now stop and look at the sunset. Sound of the game couldn't be any better. I had no issues with sound. Um, animal sounds are great. The weather sounds are great. It's just, there's there's nothing I can complain about with sound. So yeah, that's all good. Um, so graphics, sound, menu systems, they keep changing. Normally that would bother me, but the fact that... Nine, seven, six, yeah, this, this game, I, the only fault I can find with it is... Lack of poutine. couple graphical issues on the last video, but other than that, that's it. I thoroughly enjoy this game. It is exciting. You never know what's going to happen. It's just... You could be... Like, like before I died, most recently, I had it all going for me. I had perfectly stocked inventory. I had all the tools. I had a rifle with 23 rounds of ammunition left. And a wolf came up from behind, took me down to 15% condition, and I got killed before I got to the next one. Before I got in, before I managed to get indoors. Shit can change just like that. Ooh. I can click! Oh. Excuse my excitement, I've never really been able to click before. <laughs> Mittens, basic flaps. Okay, I don't know why mittens are better, but fair enough. But yeah, if you like the look of it, then you're intrigued, buy it. Simple as that. If you like what you see, just buy it. You won't regret it. I mean, there's three large areas to play around in. There's an upcoming story mode, which is going to be amazing. Simple and chill. Simple. Yeah, this is worth a purchase, basically. And I think, on that note, I'll just harvest these boots. I need some water. That'll be an episode. Hope you've enjoyed this one. It's been a little bit more slower paced. But we're getting our stuff back together again. Slowly moving forwards. We're closer now, I think, to the entrance to the Pleasant Valley. I hope we are. We've now got some ammunition, so we're reasonably defended and we have a knife as well so yeah it's looking good thank you very much for watching and i shall see you all in the next video bye, -bye.